Now, if you think you know Big Brother, you ain't seen nothing yet. It's our Uber fan finalist. Welcome back, guys. Give us a round of applause. Shawnee, it's been a week since you're on the show, mate. It has. Do you think you can do it? I'm confident. I'm really? Confident. How's the whole local celebrity thing working out for you? Shawnee's a big name in his hometown now, let me tell you. <laughs> Everyone talks about me and Ketrin. It's, cool. it's unbelievable. Of course they do, of course they do. Yeah. Jacob, how are you uh, feeling, mate? You were uh, bossing, I think it was Friday, wasn't it? Yeah, Friday. Yeah. I got Dale out of nowhere. Don't know how. I, I know, got, yeah. just plucked it. Bit of genius from yeah. deep within there. I'm starting to think I'm a big brother genius. Who yeah, you know, well, you, uh, let's hope you are this let's evening. Hope, yes. Paul, how are you feeling, mate? You were bossing it Sunday. I'm all right, a bit nervous. <laughs> really? OK, do you think you got what it takes to beat these two? I hope so. It's just best of luck out of everyone now. <laughs> oh, best of luck. That's great. Uh, that's great kind of... Uh, I can't think. Chivalry is the word I'm looking for. <laughs> right, uh, we have met them. Uh, it can mean only one thing, everybody. Live from yeah. Boreham Wood, it's the George Lum Quiz of the Decade. Oh. <laughs> Sad. I'm going to be sad to see this go, guys. Uh, each of the finalists will answer ten questions on Big Brother. They've each been allocated a different series, and to make sure it was random and above board, we got BB Golden Ticket winner Susie Verico to draw them each a specialist year. Take a look at this. The Quiz of the Decade finalist number one will be answering questions on... Big Brother 9. The Quiz of the Decade finalist number two will be answering questions on Big Brother 3. The Quiz of the Decade finalist number three will be answering questions on Big Brother 1. That's right, Uber finalists. Uh, Sean, you were given question uh, question nine. Uh, sorry, question uh, series number nine. Uh, Jacob, you were given questions about series number three. And Paul, your topic series number one, my friend. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, who well? Uh, who's? Uh, it doesn't get any better than this, does it, guys? No. My eyesight started to let me down for some reason. I can't read the autocue now. <laughs> uh, earlier on, we sent the Uber fans up to the house where they were quizzed on their chosen year by Big Brother in the diary room. <laughs> How about that? They had no idea how they did. They will be finding out, uh, and you'll find out in a short while. Prepare yourself for some shocking results for seeing three. Donal is up in the camera runs. What on earth is going on, Donal? Well, I feel like D I feel like David Attenborough here yeah. in the Virunga Mountains, looking at the wildlife from gorillas. But we don't have any gorillas. We have uh, crouching tigers, sleeping ninjas. Oh Marcus yeah, of course is there. <laughs> yeah, he's there, and there's no hint of the uh, karate and. Uh, the uh, bloody feet. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. we have... That's because uh, he was making it up, Donald. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, I, I, um, we saw the file. Now, we where's, we, I, I thought McCosey might be in doing the box task with Craig. Is that happening? Well, I can't see that, but I see out in the garden, I see the girls cheerleading there. I can't hear them, but they're... Right, OK. Are they, are they actually doing a task or are they just having a nice time? I think they're having a nice time. OK, they look, they look nice... real good. Yeah, I they're like looking that. good. Yeah, it's certainly a better uh, attempt at cheerleading than singing we heard earlier. I know, that I was shocking, yeah, wasn't it? Was, yeah. are, you, uh, are you just buzzing off the, the sheer energy that's coming from the house at the moment? <laughs> just all... resonating across you, Donal? <laughs> it's electric, no. nuclear-powered, I think... Uh... Must be like the final of Dancing on Ice, Donal. Oh, you yeah. wouldn't know what that feels like, would you? Oh, well... Oh, <laughs> I did what a night. To... Take did... care, Donal. Thanks very Pleasure. much, mate. Bye-bye, bye-bye. Right now, though, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for... Live from <laughs> So earlier on, we revealed that Uber fan Sean would be answering questions on BB9 at 1 p.m. today. He went up to the dining room where Big Brother asked him a series of questions. But before we reveal how he got on, we've got a little surprise for you, ladies and gentlemen. Please welcome BB9's Luke. <laughs> Okay, 
Yeah, OK. Uh, now, Luke isn't copying my uh, my latest fashion thing with the leg up. He's actually got an electric buzzer on his leg. All right, sit yourself down, Lukey. You remember those from last series? Just a bit. Of course <laughs> you do. And now, for every question that Sean gets wrong, guess what's going to happen, guys? Damn right he is. Damn right he is. OK, there's ten questions. He's <laughs> bound to get some wrong. Uh, OK, let's go over to the Big Brother house. Hello, Sean. You are Big Brother? How are you? Your specialist subject is Series 9. It is. Your time starts now. Question 1. What was Mohammed's surname? Oh, you got this. Got, what do you mean, no? Pass. Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! Oh, that's got a hurt. Mohammed! I'm, I'm afraid it was Mohammed, yeah? Luke knew that. Next question. <sighs> question two. <laughs> what was the name of the divide that was put in the house by Big Brother? Heaven and Hell. Oh, thank God. Oh, I got it right. Good news, yes. <laughs> question three. On what day did the housemates select their first head of house? Day 63? Oh! 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 Why is it going on? Because so, I'm doing it. It's day 38. <laughs> oh. Which housemate came third? Oh, Sarah. Came third was. Sarah, you know it. You know it. Sarah. Bam, oh. nailed it. Two in the bag. Come on, Shawnee. Come on, Sean. Surname. Stuart Stuart surname. surname. Pelkington. I thought... <laughs> it's look good. No, pass. No! Oh! No! Oh! A oh! 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 little bit more. No, no, no. A little bit more. Stop, I got no, six. It was Pilkington. Pilkington, next question. Question six. Who did Luke <laughs> be and sick? Lisa Get him a bucket. to identify in an ID parade? Rex's girlfriend Rex, and Mohammed's brother. <laughs> oh, that helps, that helps. Question seven. Stephanie auditioned to be a oh. member of which girl band? Girls Aloud. No. Nailing it. Might be, uh, might Who be a said their favourite noise was the sound of dogs barking? Oh. Um. Go easy, barking. George. Darnell. Oh! Yeah. No! No! no. It, was, it was Rachel Rice, oh, everybody. Of course it was. <laughs> What was Dale's phobia? Oh, Dale's phobia. Um, oh. Spiders. Oh, moths, you say? Moths? Oh, I can see, look, he's getting a rash or something. Right, next question. What kind of chilli did Mikey <laughs> oh. eat and that sent him That's over the edge? That's a well Sean's turned away. The Scotch bonnet. Uh, I can't remember the name, Big Brother. It was uh, when the hot... Really hot, spicy ones. George, I'll give you money. You ain't got it. Can't remember. That's true. <laughs> oh! Got it wrong. What a nightmare. Scotch bonnet it was. Sean scored four points, everybody. <laughs> Bob Luke a bit round of applause as well. Uh, find out later if that will be enough to take the crown of Quizzer of the Decade. Now, over this series, we've spoken to a host of highbrow experts like doctors and therapists, but we still 